the Dallas Cowboys are the walking piece of mediocrity. It's 20 years. We got two playoff victories in 20 years. What have they won? The Dallas Cowboys put in their fourth round pick, Dak Prescott. Now y'all acting like y'all destined for the Super Bowl. Dak Prescott is all right, but pump the damn brakes. He all right. <laughs> Did you see what happened to the Cowboys? I got one thing to say. How about them Cowboys? <laughs> it's that bad. <laughs> the Dallas Cowboys found a way to beat themselves. Y'all stink. Damn Cowboys. Damn it. Oh. The Washington Redskins hosting the Dallas Cowboys and somehow, someway, the Dallas Cowboys managed to win this damn game 27-23. And Dak Prescott, this rookie, being made to look like the second coming of Joe Montana for crying out loud. My point about the Dallas Cowboys is simple. What can go wrong will go wrong. Everybody's caught up in Dak Prescott. At some point in time, somehow, some way, folks are going to get to him. The Dallas Cowboys are playing the Green Bay Packers this weekend. I refuse to concede that they are going to win this game. I'm rolling with the Packers. Cowboys. The damn Cowboys won. To Cowboy fans out there looking at me now, the worst fan base in American history. I can't stand y'all. I can't stand y'all. I, I hate y'all. Are the Philadelphia Eagles legitimate threats to the Dallas Cowboys in the NFC East? I got to talk about the Cowboys. But everybody wants to sit up there and say, how about them Cowboys? They've won six straight. They're six and one. But we got to ask ourselves again, because you are the perpetual accident waiting to happen. The Cowboys won. There's seven games to go. Dak Prescott could get hurt Sunday. He could play like garbage the next two weeks. It's not etched in stone that they're going to win the NFC East. I can't believe they're still winning. The Dallas Cowboys will be stopped. Damn Cowboys. <laughs> Them damn Dallas Cowboys. For y'all to walk around, Super Bowl champions and all of that stuff after years, decades of ineptitude. I just, I just don't know what I'm going to do if I got to deal with the Dallas Cowboys winning the damn Super Bowl. It cannot happen. It cannot happen. Cut the damn music. And these damn Cowboys locked up last night. Nothing in America is worse in the world of sports than a Cowboys fan. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing. Cowboy fans resemble little cockroaches and ants sniffing and smelling food. And all of a sudden, they come from everywhere acting like they've been winning all along. Hope y'all had a wonderful weekend. And then you saw the Cowboys lose. <laughs> it's happening just as I planned. I actually thought that the Cowboys were going to win last night. <laughs> Tell the truth, Dallas Cowboy fans. Y'all nervous as hell, ain't y'all? These Cowboys must be stopped. Somebody has to step up and stop them. I don't care how you do it. I mean, damn it, kidnap Dak Prescott and Ezekiel Elliott if you have to. I'm trying to figure out how the hell they're going to get beat. Do I know how it's going to happen? No. Not only can it happen, not only does it have to happen, but it absolutely will happen. The Dallas Cowboys will fall. The Dallas Cowboys can end up revisiting 2007 all over again when they go 13 and 3 and don't win a damn playoff game. Yes, it is possible. Yes, I'm predicting it's going to happen. I'm picking you to lose every chance I get. To all of you Cowboy fans out there, let me tell you right now how happy I am at your misery. The fact that your team, 13 and 3, number one seed in the, in the NFC, rookie quarterback that's an MVP candidate, rookie running back that's an MVP candidate, the best offensive line in football, a team that everybody projected possibly was going to meet the Patriots in the Super Bowl. And when I see a team like the Cowboys, who have done basically nothing for the last 21 years, Walk around with everybody thinking that they're America's team. I'm not going to lie to you. It makes me think about America and say, what kind of a country have we become? I thought we were the greatest country in the world. I thought that we were about productivity, not mediocrity. I thought New England was going to the Super Bowl. I was scared as hell that the Dallas Cowboys were going to end up there. Now that the Cowboys thankfully are done, and I can look forward to Dallas Cowboy fans the world over shutting the hell up. We're going to make the Super Bowl next year. Watch. Just wait and see, Stephen A. Just wait and see. I can't stand y'all Cowboy fans. Y'all just make me sick. Sick. Armando Velasquez, F the Cowboys. 
We them boys. <laughs>